Hello community. I'm currently looking to write the perfect AI job application. So, and I asked uh, GPT-4 and you see I have web browsing enabled to have access to the latest data on the internet. I said, hey, chat GPT, search the web for how many jobs might be in danger of being replaced by AI. And it comes back and it says here, according to Goldman Sachs, as many as 300 million full-time jobs worldwide could be automated in the newest wave of AI. And they say, and this is important for me because I'm living in Europe, in the United States and Europe, approximately two thirds of current jobs are exposed to some degree of AI automation and up to a quarter of all work could be done by AI completely. So in the US and Europe, a quarter of all the work could be done by AI, which is amazing. And I had a look here at Goldman Sachs intelligence, two thirds of occupation could be done partially automated by AI. Great. So, but there is a shimmer of hope because they also say that new jobs will be created. At least they say this AI will increase the labor productivity and global GDP by 7% over a 10 year period. Now we know that extrapolations of 10 years in the future are interesting, but yeah, of course, if you reduce here the labor cost, the labor productivity features can go up. Okay. For US workers expected to be affected, 25 to 50% of their workload can be replaced by AI, as CNN reported. So up to 50% of US workers can be replaced. So I thought, hey, this is great. And it came back, yeah, I could not complete World Economic Forum site. So I say, never mind, complete your search on the World Economic Forum site. Comes back, yeah, more or less the same. And then I was interested in the positive effect of AI. So I asked, how can AI create employment growth over the long term? And it came back, new roles and in industries, increased productivity, augmentation of existing jobs. A doctor might use an A tool to analyze medical images. Yes. Lowering cost. Yes, of course. Skills shift and retraining and support an implementation role. Implementing AI system with existing businesses will require a significant amount of human labor. Okay. So I was especially interested in new roles and industry, create entirely new roles. So AI will create new jobs and new industries, like an AI ethics officer, AI trainer, or an AI maintenance specialist. And I thought, hey, wait a minute, this is just, I mean, they take care about the machines, but what about the new jobs that are created? So I went here and I said, search the web for some detailed new jobs AI will create in the future. Give me every detailed job title you can find that will be a new job created by AI. And it took some time, close to two minutes, and here Bing, Microsoft Bing came back here, told ChatGPT, this is what I found, and ChatGPT answered, I found one detailed job titled. Prompt engineer. So generative AI uses natural language processing, which lets you ask for something using normal words. Mm -hmm. A prompt engineer has to master the tricks that would work on specific generative AI. High leverage skills, 250,000 to 335,000 per year. I'm in the process of finding more job titles. I said, hey, take your time, continue. So comes back, sure, based on the research I conducted, it was again minutes. Here's what I found, said Bing. It comes back and Goldman Sachs, 300 million jobs, 80% become computerized. There is an influence of AI like ChatGPT, yes, and we will boost the global GDP by 7% over a 10 year period. I have the feeling I read this already, but anyway, 59% uh, of companies viewing AI as critical or highly critical to their business. And for the new jobs created, one example is to roll off a prompt engineer. Now, unbelievable, déjà vu is back. So I say, okay, 
Unfortunately, I ran out of time before I could find more examples of new jobs created by AI. And I said, hey, never mind, continue searching. You are Bing, you have the whole internet. You will find more than one job that is created by AI. And as you can see now, after close to, I don't know, 20 minutes and four restarts, because the computer crashed, uh, Bing crashed GPT or whatever, now we are in the fourth iteration to finally come to some additional job titles. You see, it is complex. AI is seen as a potential threat to many jobs. Yes. On the other hand, AI is also creating new roles and opportunity. 7% annually over a 10 year period. Hey, Microsoft Bing, I know this. One emerging role is prompt engineer. I'm sorry for the delay, okay? I didn't manage to find more information about other emerging jobs in the AI industry. So now this took me 20 minutes on Bing, four, four trial and errors, to come back with this one new job, a prompt engineer. So what we learned from this, at first, we learned something. Oh, yeah, now it's crashed. Beautiful. <laughs> the error in body stream. Okay. I say, Microsoft Bing, thank you for your valuable contribution. But I think I stop now. But what we learn is it is not in the pre trained knowledge body of GPT 4 anything about new jobs created by AI. And Microsoft Bing was. It took me more than a half an hour internet search, not able to find more than one new job that will be created by AI. So what we learn, the information is not yet out there. Nobody wrote about, hey, new jobs are coming up by AI. So we have now, and this will be the part of my second video, we have to think ourselves. What could be new job offers AI will create in the different industries? And I hope when you switch on the next time and you join my channel, I have more than one job title that will be created by AI. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. I see you soon.